Welcome to another episode of Block Revision and in today's trade idea section I have for you proposition of a trade on Uranium. So um, Global X Uranium ETF is a proposition for today and uh, the, one of the main reasons in order to, to consider this as a possible profitable trade is that the mm, demand for the yellow cake as uh, some uh, ec economists uh, just uh, claim uh, this uh, this commodity in that way is increasing uh, in um, the past months so what we can see is the bet on clean energy and economic rebound that uh, uh, drives um, the uranium price to the highest level since 2014 and uh, some takeaways of such um, of such um, act of such uh, mm, uh, reaction on a uh, global X uranium ETF uh, uh, rise is that uh, growth of nuclear power in numerous markets um, is uh, uh, significant and uh, bigger than it was in the recent years so uh, that's something that pushing the price to move higher so what we can see on the chart is this uh, uh, bull run uh, move that has been preceded by this very long and extended in period uh, bear market that finally had uh, its end so right now the sky might possibly uh, be the limit uh, so as we can see uh, the mm, price of uranium even in 20, uh, tw 2010 uh, was over 100 bucks per unit so right now it means there is a 4x uh, rise possibility in uh, this case okay but uh, the main question of every single investor or trader is when can I enter the market in order to achieve biggest results so in this case I would uh, just uh, take notice on that we have crossed through this uh, resistance um, set uh, in the half uh, in the first uh, half of 2021 and I've been just mm, uh, pub publishing um, you a suggestion of a mm, uh, of a short bet in this area eventually we got lower to those areas of uh, 17 uh, bucks and we have uh, rebounced very uh, very convincingly uh, from that uh, level with such spectacular rebounds we can expect that uranium ETF is not done yet as you can find we had a, a fake out over this um, recent um, resistance that uh, have been used as a, a support in uh, 2014 and uh, right now we've seen a sell-off but we, if, we, if we just uh, get to a Fibonacci extension we would see that on a Fibonacci level after this correction we have we have got a 0.5 Fibonacci level extension so it means that perfect correction is just behind us in the stock markets technical analysis um, that's very often to say that uh, after hitting 0.5 Fibonacci extension after such a run up uh, the 0.5 is uh, becoming um, strictly a mm, uh, pivotal moment and uh, uh, possibly rever reversal um, level uh, where the price will start return back to the mm, uh, initial move in, in the initial direction so uh, right now we can find that uh, we are uh, strictly above this uh, support we have um, recovered after uh, getting lower below below um, this 
uh, this strictly um, this uh, support and uh, right now uh, we can find that the bulls are stepping back on uranium chart and trying to win over any single bull bear that is um, right there yet. So in order to validate that we are still in a bull trend after this, this uh, very strong sell-off as we may say, uh, is that we are reversing also a head and shoulders pattern on a forward chart where there was a, a left shoulder head and also a right shoulder where after a sell-off and uh, getting lower below this 23.8 we have recovered and rescued uh, the bull bull run as right now we can see. So reversing a bearish formation in technical analysis is a double signal upside. So as we can find that uh, we are um, in a, a very good spot in order to take a long position to at least the next uh, resistance right now at around 27.5 and 28 point uh, five as we can uh, mm, we might uh, mm, draw here a, a supply uh, zone so okay so in order to make a trading bolt and to find a possible um, chance for us to uh, make some mm, gains uh, we may uh, just set it over right here with a possible um, reward of this one so risk reward ratio for this trade I assume to be at 2.2 uh, level uh, you can also uh, just uh, copy over uh, this mm, uh, this trading board mm, uh, extensions uh, to the upside and to the downside as you can find mm, this to be right here uh, the uh, upper limit is at 27.8 and uh, mm, uh, down uh, the um, this um, um, bottom limit is uh, right at the 23.13 as this red uh, red label is telling us in terms of um, area of an entrance that I assume and this trade to be valid I would just put this to be here uh, with a limit on 23.8 and also uh, the higher limit at 25.09 so if the price will get mm, uh, past any of these limits I wouldn't find this trade to be uh, th this trade proposition to be uh, still valid so keep in mind uh, this mm, thing okay so uh, there's um, there is a possibility of making some uh, some decent uh, gains uh, but remember about uh, risk management and setting alarms mm, right at the bottom of uh, this um, risk area and also if you not uh, right at the screen just put a stop loss okay so that's it for today's episode thank you very much for watching and see you in the next episode